Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches. I'm Fred Woods, ready to teach. Hi boys and girls, today we're going to talk about subtraction. You know what that means? Let's take a look here. We have some vocabulary that says, how many left? So if I take something away from a group, how many do I have left? Here's the word subtraction. You know what that sign is for a, a sentence, a number sentence? There it is. That's a subtraction sign. That's different from the equals sign, and there's the word equals. We have minus sign, subtract, take away, cross off, equals, or break apart. So if I have three things here and two things here, and I break it apart, how many do I have over here? So those are the types of things we're going to be working on with subtraction. Today, let's review a couple of things with subtraction. If you notice, I have a bunch of orange squares up here. But if you don't have orange squares or blocks or anything like that, you can use money, like quarters, nickels, or pennies. See how I have them those up there? But I'm going to take this off, and I'm going to come back, and we're just going to be working with the orange squares. Okay, boys and girls, as you can see, I just have the orange squares. Let's count how many we have. I have one, two, three, four, five orange squares. If I have five and I take away two, how many do I have left? I have one, two, three. See how that works? Let's bring these two back up. If I add two back in, how many do I have? I have one, two, three, four, five. Now, if I subtract three, how many do I have left? So if I subtract three, that means I remove them. And I have one, two left. Let's try something different. This is kind of a word problem. If I have a house with five cats, can you put up your hand like this? Five cats? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. If one of the cats leaves, how many cats do we have left? And the cats goes out the door and leaves outside. So how many cats do we have left? Count them. Remember, you can hold up your fingers, and if one of the cats leaves, we can fold a finger in. And how many do we have left? Right. We have four cats left. Now, we have four cats in the house. If two more cats leave, how many do we have left? So we have one cat leaves, two cats leave. Now, how many do we have left? Right. We have one, two cats. Remember, we had four, and we have two that left. So now we have two fingers up. See the different strategies we have where we can look at things like that? Let's take a look at some other stuff. Hi, boys and girls. Remember the orange squares that we had before? And the cats, too. Let's take a look here. We have one, two, three, four, five orange squares. And how many cats do we have? Right. We have one, two, three. Now, how many orange squares do you have to remove to have the same number of squares as you have cats? Well, let's take a look. We have one, two, three cats. Let's count off the squares again. One, two, three. Oh! If we take away the last two squares or subtract them, now how many squares do we have? We have one, two, three. 
the same number as cats. Hi friends! Remember what a 10 frame is? It means it has 10 dots in it, right? But we're working with orange squares. Let's take a look. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We have 10 items. That's like having our 10 fingers. Remember, this is a strategy for figuring it out. If we take away one, how many fingers do we have left up? Let's look at it with the orange squares, too. I'm going to take away one. How many do we have left? Correct. There's nine. Let's count it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine left when we take away one. Okay, let's try something else. If I want to take away four, remember our fingers, we have ten fingers and we have ten orange blocks. I'm going to take away four. How many do we have left? Let's verify your answer. So if I have one, two, three, four, I'm going to take those away or subtract them from the 10 frame. I'm just going to put them up here for right now. They'll, they'll be safe. So how many do we have left? We know this is 5. If we count on from 5, so it goes 5, 6. We have 6 left when we take away 4. Good job. That's it for today. We're going to have more tomorrow. We can cross the river, river of emotion, full of love and waves, waves of desperation, empty hearts and mouths with us.